So when you first open Sibelius, this is what it brings you. And I have a couple different templates in here. As you can see, a project I'm working on is called Huzu, a cabaret style production. But I want to get into one of my compositions. So we're going to click on my recents and go into tissue. So this one's not exactly done yet. But if you look here, we have um, a pretty detailed composition on some lines here. I'm going to go pretty slowly. Um, the piano, the keyboards here really drive home the sound. And for the sound of this, I'm using it. It sounds online, East West Sounds, um, Yamaha piano. I like the timbre of the Yamaha piano for a lot of my compositions. Um, I do also like the Bugendorfer. Um, it's a really great pack between the three pianos that I, I switched between. So I like the Yamaha, the Bugendorfer, and the Steinway um, Masters. Uh, just so you know, when I step into my next screen, I have, this is what the instrumentation looks like so far. So I have an alto sax, um, is wind one, a trumpet, trombone, um, drum kit. I have, uh, this says electric guitar, but I'm using a classical nylon guitar for that. Um, electric bass, keyboard, synthesizer, violin, and cello. So with Sibelius, you can actually add in east-west sounds. On here and as you can see I have um, up here at the top under my one of my configurations I have ZRW music of Arizona that's my configuration that allows me to use east-west sounds so we're gonna go in the mixer and you can see this is what it looks like when I'm mixing if you wanted to change between whether or not you're using Sibelius play sounds or um, play which is the software for um, sounds online east west you would just click down and you can choose between the two now if you're going to use play which is a third-party vst you have to pay attention to these channels here so when you click on play down here it's going to bring up this this is play so we're looking at, let's look at my keyboard line here. If I want to add a keyboard pack from play, all I have to do is click on my packs over here. So as you can see, I have East West Piano Steinway and Pianos Gold Yamaha. For this composition, I really like Yamaha, so we're gonna go with that one. There's a couple different options here. And over time, as you play with uh, Sounds Online, East West Sounds, Composer Cloud, you can actually learn which ones that you like to use more often. So we're going to use Yamaha Master, and we're going to add that. So, and then over here, if you want the piano line to line up with the instrument you have in Sibelius, all you do is look at Channel 1, Channel 1, and you change Omni to one to match the channel. And right there, it's not playing right now because my sound is chained into this recording, but it would play the piano. And on the line here, that would be the only sound that comes out. Now, if you start, if you hit play and start um, previewing your track and it's all the instruments are playing at once, it's because you missed the step. So you have to add the channel that you want corresponding with the instrument. If you were looking to, um, how do you even add it into Sibelius? Try to remember how I got there. Play configuration. Oh, you click right here on this little drop down, and it would show up right here. So play is a VST, and then you hit activate, and it moves it over here. Now, if you're like, how does play even show up? When you install play, it'll ask you, do you want to put it in your VST folder? And you'll say yes. 